All right, Arthur Connor fiddles can be found around the world, but they were created in Floyd County. That's pretty cool. Yeah. WDBJ 7's Katie Rochetko introduces us to the man behind the music. The sound of a violin is enchanting. It's something over kind of gets a hold of you in here. It's so pretty, I think. But to hear a violin in the shop where it was created. This is an extraordinary thing. Arthur Connor is 94 years old. He and his wife Eileen are Floyd County treasures. He carries on a craft done in the same way it's been done for you know, 100 years. For almost 50 years, Connor has cut and chiseled the wood of hundreds of trees. He still uses old school 19th century methods and techniques and tools. Turning them into legendary pieces of art. I've made a lot of instruments. I've made several violins and violas and made uh, four cellos, I think, and two bass fiddles. His love for music was inherited. My daddy loved music, yeah. But Connor says he didn't get the musical talent he wished he had. I'm not much of a player, no. So instead, he started making instruments. <laughs> Kept growing and growing and getting better and better, and I think I had a little help from somewhere. Eventually selling them to talented musicians like Mike Mitchell. And that was 20 years ago. I've been playing his violins ever since. Mitchell says it's Connor's old-fashioned craftsmanship that makes his instruments so special. This shop for 50 years, it, it could have been 1995 or it could have been 1945 or it could have been 1895. And that is unique. In Floyd County, Katie Roshetko, WDBJ7. Don't you love what he we, said? Can we re it, that? Just roll that again, please. It's something that gets a hold of you right here. I, I like it. Had a little help from somewhere. It's pretty good stuff. I mean, and, and I, I like that sound bite too. He said, you, you walk in the shop, you don't know if it's 95, mm -hmm. 1885. I mean, unbelievable. Yeah. And the fact that he said Talent. he can't really play, but he can make them. I know. I love that. Wouldn't what that a be great, something? What a great story. <laughs> I uh, actually Floyd County though I'm not I, you know Brent I'm not surprised the last time I was in Floyd County I mean just the talent that oh, comes out of Floyd County as far as music and hearts. art yeah, yeah it's 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 incredible so they took all the all that and just put it all in one one spot mm -hmm. you know and I think probably too I mean if you drive or drive through there it's everything is just so chill you know yeah. mm -hmm. you just got that just you know you just care in the world yeah exactly and I think that plays a part in it what a cool story though mm -hmm. the fact that he makes those all right let's